Back in Western New York, fire departments are looking for new volunteers as part of an effort across New York State this weekend. Townline Fire Department today hosted a recruiting event. Two on your side's Keelan Berrien joins us from the newsroom now with more. Hello, Keelan. Hey, Dave. Yeah, the recruiting event is called Recruit New York Weekend. It's been happening for about 10 years now, and it involves all volunteer fire departments across the state. Now, Jennifer Brosk, a president of Townline Volunteer Fire Department, says these events are critical because it's been so hard to recruit people. She says it's been that way for the past decade, but she understands because volunteer fire dividers do not get paid. She says big cities in the state are usually the ones that have paid fire departments, while smaller areas are all volunteer. We rely 100% on volunteers. Only the big cities have paid firefighters. So we rely on people just like, just like the people who came here today. Um, I, I'd say at least over the last 10 years, recruiting volunteers has been difficult just because I don't think people have the time. We run a lot of calls, we have a lot of training, but it's a very rewarding job to do. And it doesn't take as much time as you think. She says if you're if you're one to not want to go into a burning building, that's OK, because there's many jobs to choose from. That includes being a driver, EMT, exterior fighter fighting and more. Brasa says about 75 percent of, of their calls are EMT calls, so they're also looking for those heavily on your side in the newsroom. Keelan Barry and Channel 2 News.